Yeah, so as I said before, this is the design I made today, my book, Couple Design. You can see it in blue and pink for women and men. We have this one as a new one. Yeah, like I said, every day new design. You see the, the f my favorite one. I like this one too. It's 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 poetry here. Uh, I like freedom. This one, and my favorite is the fox, the dream catcher. This one is my favorite, and this one is also nice. Like as you you can see the the words like. Yeah, uh, we have a bunch of design. You may like it. So make sure to check the store to purchase something from here as a support for us guys. Just. It's not gonna take much of you you're gonna choose just one of them guys make click on it puff and buy that's that's the easy step you choose we have different color you may you choose the color and you just click we have different as you can see and different tie as your size as you see you just click add it to cart and buy it and support us for making more reaction guys thank you and let's go to the video Welcome guys with another reaction with the Toxic channel. Uh, I hope you're doing well. In my side, I'm doing good. So today I have time, so I do, I'm doing a bunch of reaction guys. And I'm doing bu a bunch of your suggesting guys. And this one is also by Kevin Samuel. Uh, the people who's not familiar with... Uh, I'm also not familiar with... It's <laughs> uh, just suggested by the comment. But I know him. That's what I'm saying. I know him. He have the same message as Andrew Tate had. I have. But uh, Kevin is, is like... Uh, I would not say soft, but I would say like it's too much calm. He 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 delivered the message differently, but they are both have the same message. But this one they delivered differently, calmly. He know how uh, to not gain the ray the the, the the range from other people. Like they gonna react with him calmly. They not hate on him, and he's very intellectual. So we're gonna see. So if I wanted a high value man, what do I do? Be reincarnated. Are you a virgin? <laughs> no. Buy a dog, die alone. Fuck attraction. No. What the fuck? He just no no. Okay, maybe it's a museum. Ah. Oh, okay. That's just a uh, first first clip. This one is top ten savage uh, savage uh, savage moments. So I don't think he's gonna he gonna be intellectual. He's gonna roast everybody here. They don't love you. The guys you want aren't asking you out. Get the fuck out of my phone. The rest of us do not have to suffer you. You had no problem showing your dick. Okay, sorry. I thought he was calmly. So they had the same message and they say it differently in a crazy way. Type dude. Overall, does that make you below average, average, or above average? Factor all those things in together. Average. So no, it's good she's below average cannot have a high value man she's below average why should you get anything over then why should you get above average what do you mean settle for you should and get I what see, you are i see i see millionaires with average women all the time no nah, you're not you're below you cannot man, have a millionaire you right? got two children and you said you are six i give you okay five six you, just, just, you your numbers together would be average so mm -hmm. why so an average man would be upgrading to get you look I didn't say I'm asking. That. I'm asking. Delusion. Would you say that you're a woman that's uh, in high demand or most wanted? No. I could be. I mean, truthful. Yeah, I be could truthful. Be. I mean, you could be. I, so I take, okay. So so I so. Care. Can I tell listen, you, listen, can listen, I tell you listen, about, listen. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ma'am, you're 37 with two children. Oh, okay. Where in the world do women who are Average to above average look, average to cute, who are a little overweight with two kids. Where are these women in high demand? So if I wanted a high value man, what do I do? Be reincarnated. You can't get one. I'm dating this guy now who's a high, pretty high value. And we, we've been talking How about How old is he? He's 51. Uh huh. And what makes him high value? He owns his own uh, car dealership. Uh huh. And he has multiple businesses. Uh huh. Uh, he owns houses. Like, uh huh. He's doing, he's doing pretty good for himself. He's okay. probably not rich, but. Ma'am, being high value is more than just money. He's a mover or shaker. Yeah, a most he, eligible. He okay, got... ma'am, but these men don't settle. They don't settle. They don't get women who are. 
They don't, they don't, they don't. Uh, there, there are men on, on YouTube right now saying, I don't know what I'm talking about, about being high value. But here's one thing that they do agree with me on. They don't take a woman with children. They don't. I've had men who vehemently disagree with me on a lot of things. They don't listen to me, but unanimously, we don't take another man's children because that's not even in, our, in their mindset. They don't. It's a little bit true, though. It's a little bit true. So you ladies can call it what you want, and I'm thinking, if the, they how long have y'all been dating? Um, two weeks now. I said seriously, but considering you to be a wife, in two weeks, ma'am, yep. Yeah. Mm. I juggle it with getting a high value man back Thanks. that um, I felt like I lost because I wasn't ah. um, in therapy. I wasn't. Okay. Um, I wasn't ready. Give him, and give him being savage here. He said I needed to get therapy, and I really want him. Okay. It was ended. He said that you need to yeah. get your your stuff together. He said, literally, I need to get therapy. Have you so, done that? Yes, I've been in therapy from that time. So, yes, All right. I'm, I'm All still right. in therapy. When was the last time you've spoken to this man since your breakup? Um, I haven't just over a year since that time, but it's mm -hmm. since all that has passed. Mm -hmm. um, and I felt like I lost him. I, I moved on and. Uh -huh. I got married, but I don't want to be with You got him. married? Yeah. You're currently married? Yes. I'm oh, married, yeah. no, no, no. What happened? Mm -mm. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Ma'am, are you trolling me? No, I'm not. You, you broke know, up. This guy called it out, and instead of, and you said you wouldn't gotten to help me, yeah. and you're married. And you're actually you're actively on a platform with a million folks actively talking about leaving your husband to get back with your ex. Because he's high value. Well, I'm going to go What's ahead wrong with this man. woman? I've heard some pretty interesting things. Just cut her and fuck off. I'm doing this show. But um you probably have to be probably the, probably the worst woman I've ever spoken to. What? Wow. Yeah. I've heard a woman that actually was going to leave her, but at least she waited for her husband to be in remission before she left him. Now, I was hoping you were trolling, but the more you talk, the more realistic you are. So I honestly hope whoever knows this woman's husband Make sure he watches this video. Let me just go ahead and net it out for you. You ready? Uh-huh. The guys you want aren't asking you out. 35, 13-year-old son with a sketchy father. Why would a man who's in the top 10% of earners who women across the country want, want that? Um, Because I have a lot to offer what would you rank yourself on a scale from one to ten you cannot use seven would i rate myself mm -hmm, just your face um my face when i wake up five but when i put myself together six okay and how tall are you basically he said do not use um he said do not use seven so he says she said six well i uh, if i rank her i will rank her lower i will even lower 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 I don't understand why women are afraid of saying the truth about themselves. There is nothing to be afraid about. Just say the truth about yourself and how you see yourself in the mirror. Because I don't believe that she sees herself in the mirror by she she is a seven or six. She's much lower. But anyway, as as a man, I would say like uh, if I'm a four, I would say I'm a four. If I'm a three, I would say I'm a three. You know, but to to be able to say. I'm a ten. You need to have everything. Just not not just the good look. Uh, the good uh, good look. You need to have the money. You need to have the the, ha the house. You need to have the status. You need to have the charisma. You need to have a bunch of things to be able to say I'm an eight or a seven. So it depends on all this. Where how you rank yourself by the charisma, the status, the confidence, and then how you rank yourself. You, by by uh, I don't think a man would rank himself by just look. Oh look, I'm in the mirror. 
Okay, I'm no, I don't think it goes like this. Ranking doesn't go like this. That's what I believe in anyway. Five five. Dress size. I'm sorry? Your dress size. A three. Okay. So that makes you if you give yourself a five, that's average. Average, yeah. yeah. So <laughs> average looking women tend not to get high earning men. That's kind of a true, though. They tend to get average men. So, um... Did you, did you, I mean, stop right there. Stop right there. Stop right there. Really breathe savage. and digest. So, what is your advice for, uh, women okay. that... All right, I'll tell you my advice, man, because you're not listening to me. This is why I always recommend you need, you need, need therapy. Every, people think most of us... Are no need for therapy again. No need for therapy. If I would give her an advice, I would not advise her for therapy. I'd, I would advise her to be less delusional and to be more realistic and just to be much more free about herself and much more confident about herself. I am average. I'm not searching for a high value man. I'm just searching for a man who cares and loves me and he's, he's ready to provide for me. That's all. You don't need to work for a high value man because a high value man will not settle for nobody, especially in average girl. The black community need therapy, but you're not you're not dealing with reality. Yeah, exactly. I mean, She's like not dealing woman, with the reality. But you don't, but you're not getting. She, it. she need to be more she realistic. So I'm not being. Don't tell me I'm being mean. I've, He's being uh, true though. I'm about to be mean. I get tired <laughs> of you broads telling me I'm being mean because you cannot handle the goddamn truth. You called my show <laughs> on a day that you ain't even supposed to be here, and I honored the call and sat here and tried to help you. And I'm telling you, telling me I'm being mean. Get the fuck out of my phone. I want the men that you want walking along. They want all the qualities that I have. I would. Well, then you should have no problem. You yeah. know, by Kevin Samuel, I watched him before when Andrew Tate was go uh, was becoming viral. Uh, Kevin also was becoming viral with with Andrew in the same time, and they have different. Ma they have the same message, but differently. I I thought also Kevin is like more calm, but no, it's just his voice is much calmer. But he's savage also. In all cases, uh, the difference between Kevin Samuel and the Fresh and Fit is that they invent, uh, they inv invite, sorry, they invite uh, women who have OnlyFans and they are doing uh, already a lot of money on OnlyFans and doing well and stuff. But Ke with the difference between Kevin Sa and Kevin Samuel, he invite randomly, like the, the, you can call him and speak about your issues, speak about this. It's, it's like randomly. And that's how you're going to have a b bigger vision rather than just fresh and fit. Because in fresh and fit, you see only the, the women on, on OnlyFans, most of them OnlyFans, and only who have a lot of followers on Instagram and they're already doing a lot of money. So they will not have other thinking. But this kind of woman, like, you're going to have a bigger vision in this with Kevin, you, a bigger vision with it because he's speaking randomly with women who ha doesn't have a big followers, who are not doing OnlyFans, and they have this all in common, the same point. So that's how you have the bigger vision. It's, I would recommend you to watch Fresh and Fit, but for me, uh, I wasn't familiar with him. I just watched him clip, but uh, as I'm saying uh, so far, I understand that he have a big, uh, bigger audience. That's what I'm saying. Because no most of them are random. Well, but, 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 but apparently that's not what they want. That's what you want. What about what he wants? He Okay, let's let's say this. How much money would you want your husband to really earn annually? Oh. To live the life you want, to eat, travel, hair, makeup, shopping, caring for family. Come on, give it to me. Don't don't hide it. Uh, Five hundred thousand. All right. What percentage of men earn that? Five hundred thousand. <laughs> Five hundred thousand is a, is a lot of money, but I would say like this. Uh, it's not a really big mistake because I believe every man is searching for to make in a lot of money and for the people who's not searching for to make a lot of money, they're, they're fucking lazy then. So I believe in every man, he needs to search for to have a lot of money and to provide for his wife and his children and give them the life that they deserve anyway. So for her seeking for a man that he, he give her the life that she wants, it's not really, like we say, it's not, it's not it's not a gold digging you know if she's loyal to him if she's doing everything that she um, a woman's supposed to do then uh, giving her less than she deserves then it's uh, it's his fault that's what i'm seeing it my well. point
what percent? No. I mean, if you're talking all races, I would think. I just said what percentage of men earned that? Athletes. Oh, maybe like, what, 7% or something? No, oh, I, I believe. What percent? Not 1%. 1%? Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's, it's kind of a true because the majority, uh, I, I don't know how much the percentage, but because but a lot of people doesn't earn uh, doesn't earn that amount of money, five hundred thousand. So the, it's a little bit delusional, but I believe everyone, every man, w want to be rich, and most of them that doesn't do the work. And we all show, shall we do the? We all should do the work anyway so to be why rich. Why aren't the men who want that approaching you? Because they do exist. They do. Are they still playing games? Maybe they're out here just. No. They're the ones towing it up because it's not me. No. See, it's see, see, and this is what I find interesting. You ladies always go to well, they even if they are there, they got to be doing something wrong because it's all right with me. Do you make room for the possibility maybe they're just reading that you're not what you say you are, even though that's what you want them to believe? What is it? I mean, I can't read minds, but maybe. Well, but but but, but the only the only other way it works in your world is yeah, they exist. But they're out there. But they're out there playing games. And it's, see, it's always a problem with the men. It's never. It's never right here. Not not all of them. I'm just saying the ones that come in contact to you that do approach, mm -hmm. and I'm hoping that they're intentional with that approach. Well, but I'm not. But see, the thing is, what I'm saying is the men that approach. I'm not saying that all the men who approach you. Are the, I'm not saying you're being approached by the kind of men you want. I'm saying why aren't you being approached by the men you want? I am being approached by the men that I want, but I feel like they're out there playing games but also we're in a different realm we're talking like uh, the men i believe the same message they are all asking the same message the men that she want they're not gonna settle for her that's what it is that's life that she, like she that should just move the, on or you know yeah people that i'm on the scene with so yeah, i don't worry i don't concern myself with athletes and entertainers i know the lifestyle i concern myself with that right and that's i think usually where i'm in the event you know well then then you get what you deserve then you get what you deserve and you know, that's what you do really. you get what you deserve you know what comes with that lifestyle i'm talking about the people who actually have to go make their money you just said this one ma'am you want a man who's making five hundred thousand dollars a year and you're attracted to and yes. he doesn't want kids i do want kids okay and, and to be a selfish to be a <laughs> questionable brother mess and the point is man the point is what you're basically trying to get what you're trying to get the audience to accept is these men don't exist and i've showed over and over for months and months they do exist they just don't want women like you they and make they, or they're and not that's not an insult or they not it's not an insult women like me no 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 like, they don't they no 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 see you keep see, see, see the thing is this is what you just said they're not ready for women like you. There's always a deficit on the men's side. No, they don't want you. Those men do not want me. But when they, they approach, don't. when they approach, and, and here's the thing: listen, me and asking me to marry them. And listen, them men, listen. But then when we sit around listen. and come out and about, like, see, what? she's not now. Not now. Your ego's involved. Listen, no, no. you ladies control access to sex. We control access to relationship. So you can say whatever you want. We control access to relationship, and they don't want it with you, and they're going to get it from another woman. Fuck attraction. You're supposed to be the attractive one. Oh, fuck. Okay. Yeah, I don't care about your attraction. I don't care about love either. Why do you women think you get it all? Moment five. Oh, you understanding, or me understanding. If you have all this trauma... As, as you can see, as you can see, guys, uh... They are randomly, they call him randomly. And that's why you have the bigger vision to understand how really they th the women think and stuff like this. And he, they give you really good points for the people who are really interested to know how women think and stuff like this. Uh, yeah, I like Kevin, but I'm not really interested to see how this kind of things goes. But it's nice to, to react to them from, or to watch them from time to time. But I have other things... I will react to them anyway, but and and there is nothing hard about seeking for other things to understand this and to understand this. But mo but most of the time, I like to may 
to educate myself about the real world and what is going on with the real world with the politics uh, stuff the history even though i'm not good with history but i'm trying to read as much as i can and try to understand the world and try to understand how the investments work so this kind of thing to understand how women think is a lot i don't think it's i'm going to do reaction to them though anyway that i'm just saying my point of view that they're not really important to me but i'm going to do reaction to them to understand and to see go Seek professional help because the rest of us do not have to suffer you. Then women understand and hear that being 200 pounds at five foot tall is unhealthy. But yet 80% of our women are overweight and 80% of that is obese. They know the truth. They choose and to the do something else. The narrative pushed to us most often is that a guy wants a woman with a big ass. He wants you know a thick lady accountability. We always... accountability is kryptonite to modern women That's you're not... 24 years old is your, circum is your circumstance harder or easier than your grandmother and your great grandmother exponentially easier we have right. access the, to information great. we didn't exponentially have. easier but you're handling it worse your grandmother and your great grandmother actually could work with a black man with more trauma because they understood that the black woman and the black man are on the same side. Now that we are all free and independent and to, we could do whatever we want to, why would we seek to, you know, be one with the black man? We, we even you. think that being- Thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't think you know what you're talking about regarding OnlyFans, that's for sure, because- Invite him also on Fresh and Fit. That's what I was talking about it before. They invite him in Fresh and Fit, and we're gonna. Those are already have million, uh, a lot of followers. They are already on OnlyFans. They are already making a lot of money. So I believe that he's gonna be savage here. Let's check it, guys. I'm not gonna speak here. We're gonna just to check it. But you know what I'm talking about as far as business and making money. In regards to making money, money comes in waves, and we all have to understand that. And if we all invest successfully, we could. Where are you but investing? Where are you investing? People, people are. Where are you investing? Average. Where are you investing? That's none of your business. It's it's a secret. 